the idea for the treehouse actually came from uh, a student three or four years ago uh, who made the suggestion that uh, building a treehouse would be a fun project for NG120. Um, in order to build a treehouse on campus, though, we needed to get coordination from a number of different folks on campus, including facilities and engineering, um, as well as the dean of undergraduates. The kind of parameters we were given was that we couldn't hurt the tree, so we couldn't put any bolt screws or nails into the tree, and then um, anywhere that's touching, we had to put mats so it doesn't rub which makes it a lot more complicated than your standard backyard treehouse where you can kind of put one major bolt through the middle and that's the big support factor for it. And if these are the right length, then we can position them based on this. Yeah, that's what we were gonna do. Agreed. This really is the largest NG120 project we've built both in physical scale and also in the time that it's taken to build it. These students are getting a unique experience in that they've never been forced to master tools and then build right away. Or, yeah, we're going to get this cut. I think the first build day when we started making the posts and just realizing like how big these pieces of wood are. And then once we got the main beam into the middle of the tree and seeing like, wow, that's what 10 feet really is. Um, we're kind of the moment, like the eye opening moments like this thing is massive. We can cut the 45. I think our biggest improvement is has been being able to pl actually plan for this, like plan out the, our build days, because before we just go out and try and wing it, and that didn't work at all. But now we plan out every little step. So we spend a lot of time talking about what NG120 is and what these engineering design experiences look like. But this is really what you do in this class and in this engineering design experience, is that you plan your project out and you execute it, and this one just happens to be in public. We don't typically do things as large, and we definitely don't do them in the middle of mechanical engineering and Ryan Lab. And so we're very excited to bring something that improves the grounds of rice that's made by freshmen. We started this project at NG120 in the fall of 2015, and we've worked um, pretty much week in and week out on this project until now. There have been many ups and downs. The students have really developed their skills uh, in terms of construction. Um, we've learned a lot, all of us, in terms of what's feasible, what's not feasible, how to make things work, how to put things together. It's nice. It's good to be yeah. done. It's awesome. <laughs> it, it feels good. We finished.